kind of doing I this do just like stabilize them. Yeah, it's pretty much what I'm doing is is basically how you know um, the the companions Base. are for Ve you yeah know, like Boris is and for E, but you know I, I don't well, I don't want to outright kill them. Because that would just why, that would kill dirt, man. I mean, dirt would literally right. <laughs> dirt the daring well, would probably would jump. Him. The longer you let him keep him, Dave, the more dirt's gonna be when you take him away. Nobody's taking him. Oh, but he knows. Well, he could, dirt knows. He could still hang around, just not be. He's gonna go to fighting. a farm and hang out on a nice farm and Pasture retire. Him. <laughs> gonna retire on a farm where I can go visit him. Play with the carp. <laughs> Arbor dear, how bad are you? I'm uh I'm at half. Seven out of sixteen, just below half. So yeah, you, you stabilized the wolf. Uh he was still at zero. He was still unconscious with spare the dying, so um How many dirt, health potions do we have? Dirt crammed out health potion one. down his throat, so that that's what's Sar probably around. has around like Brought five. Yeah. Zar? What are you guys doing? You guys see this? Uh, we're, we're talking over you. A supply room. Yeah, we're talking over you. Go for it. Um, Lazar, do you have any health potions to give Arvadir or me? Oh, I, I just have the one that I started out with. Luckily, I hadn't had to use it. So. I can always. I'll, I'm gonna. Right. I that plan on bringing him back Arvidir later. Our weekend. Stains, uh, meaning not stains. Too good. He's not feeling too good. I've got one maybe a lycanthrope or something. I don't know. No health potions. That's we'll once once Vegas gets right? back though. Uh, take we, a rest. Run the chase. If are you? Yeah, we could take a. a short they can't rest hear me you talking, want. you guys. You want to stay here for one hour once doors. we're letting glass staff run away? Right. I'm sorry, are you retarded? That's that's fine. It's probably gone by now. Wizard, you're job. holding us up. <laughs> <laughs> <You're good. laughs> Alright, so we'll go we'll turn base. Uh, Arvaldir, what are you doing? I'm chugging my potion. My last potion. Do okay. oh, you have a potion? Yeah, I have one. I'm going to chug it, I said. He had one. Oh, I thought, you, I thought you had none. So, that's why I was asking Lazar if he had any. Oh my god. 2D4 okay, plus then I'm going gonna, gonna to cast Cure Wounds on myself then. He's got magic for him. Oh. Well, no. oh. I know. I'm just. I'm. I'm just having fun. No, I, I'm having fun, dude. I'm on weekend. I, I wouldn't have expended a heal on on a dog anyway. So that, that's just on the wolf. That's just me. So. Right. Right. All right. So you it's get not, five HP, Arvader. Are you uh? On weekend. Are you still not weakened or weekend. not weakened? Okay. Gotcha. Not. All right, so uh, you've gone ahead and taken your action to administer a potion to yourself, Dirt. What are you doing? You've got stains. He's back up. Uh, what are you doing, Dave? I'm gonna go over here to these barrels and start searching through these barrels. All still over Lion here. Shield coaster barrels, crates, boxes, sacks, all of that stuff. Anything good in them? Uh, water, wine. There's a lot of uh, like uh, building materials, like. Uh, shingle, wooden shingle nails, uh, regular nails for looks like wooden planks, stuff like that. Okay. And then I'm gonna go over here and check out this water and like clean off the blood and stuff in it. Okay. By my hands. Then I'm gonna take a little clean scoop of it and drink it. Okay. Oh, actually, the the water is. Is really nice and cool. It's it's actually a, a really cold water. It tastes really good. You haven't had water this cold in in quite a while since the uh, since the battle with the giants to the north. And when you the last time you had cool water. Into the water. A cup, a handful, <laughs> drink it. All right. All right. So that's it for dirt. Uh, what about uh, Rogar? You want to go over there and kick him into the water? Yeah, I want to cure, cast cure wounds on myself and then go kick dirt into the water. So you speak like me and you need a bath. <laughs> go ahead and roll your uh, roll your heroes. Is that going to take you over bloodied as well? Yeah, I'm right on the cusp. So, so I'm back at full health actually. Okay, go over and do your uh, attack versus your your grab attack versus versus dirt. His strength for sure strength. Add an athlete as well. 
match, an arm wrestling match. Dirt, you can use either strength or dex, but I'm sure you'll you'll probably just want to use strength. Yeah. Hey. All right, Dirt, go ahead and make your roll. <laughs> it's successful. Uh, how do you fucking manage sometimes, man? He, uh, Holy shit. He actually, he, he stops you. <laughs> right. I he stop his dice roll more than mine. I stop him, I look at him, and I give him that look like, don't ever try that again. All right, so this, uh, as you guys are looking into the cistern or fountain, you see that uh, it is definitely rectangular. Uh, the water is very clean, and uh, you could see uh, that the water was actually refreshing because dirt, you know, said, oh, nice. Uh, you look down, uh, it is 10 feet deep, and basically there's uh, the cistern actually, the, the water is level, and then, the, the, you know, the edge of the cistern is another two feet over the water. So that's that's basically what you see. So it's basically eight feet of water, ten feet bottom? total. Is that what you want? Uh, do you want to? Uh, you you can go ahead and look in there. You can give me a quick perception yeah, check. I'd like to look in there, see if it's a wishing well. Two. An investigation or perception. Uh, you can give me a per just give me a perception. That's fine. Perception. All right. Uh, no, you don't see anything out of the ordinary. It's just, uh, you know, like I said, about 10 foot total, 8 feet of water, 2 foot above the water to the top of the, the cistern. So, All right, so, uh, Lazar, what are you doing? Lots of supplies. There's another door to the to the west as well. Oh, yeah. I'm actually going to check these couple of bodies right here in front of me, see if there's anything worth value. Okay. So... Uh, on the bottom, uh, on the on the bottom, on um, all of the bodies. First off, uh, I want to go ahead and give you guys uh, 300 total XP, so you guys can divide 300 EXP as well. And uh, the red brands. 75, 75 each. Yep, the red brands have some some treasure. Uh, there are uh, there is a total of. Fifteen gold between uh, fifteen gold between all gold. three, and there are twenty gold and gems as well. the The last guy that you checked had had a couple extra gems that are about twenty about twenty gold worth of gems. So okay, <clears throat> and the door the, the door is actually open. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead and, and open this door as well for you. Should have probably had, had done that uh, a little while ago. Sorry about that. So you can actually uh, see into the the room here. All right. So uh, anything else you want to do there, Lazar? Uh, no, that's that's about it actually. All right. So what do you guys think? What do you guys want to do? I mean, I can keep going. Oh, that door was open. But uh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, it was, yeah, it was I would have saw that if I kicked dirt in, so... Yeah, I just didn't we'd open definitely it. definitely go investigate. Poof, the door magically opens. Uh, it's more... I mean, a ton of supplies in here as well. All Lion Shield Coster, man. This is like an entire shipment <laughs> of store supplies. And in here, there's, you know, in the barrels, there's there's some fresh grain. There's uh, more building supplies. There's also uh, uh, water about three or four bo uh, barrels of water as well. And a couple beds. These these beds aren't as nice as uh, old Larna's bed, but uh, they would do. Especially for the Silver Fox. The F Silver Fox isn't, uh, he's not too picky when he's when he's tuckered out. Well, I tell them to check the beds since we found something in Larna's bed, so you guys make sure you check those beds. I'll do just that. Perception, right? Search for search, search for any. Yeah, and uh, if you're doing like yeah, that would be investigation. So. All right. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, investigation. Sorry. There you go. Um. Nope. You searched through all the messages. Uh, 
the mattresses, the pillows, and all the crates, like I said, you know, basically just barrels of water, uh, building supplies, and some grains. That's pretty much everything in the in the entire room. This uh, 15 so by 20 foot room. Door, right? Yeah. Yep. It's it's elevated. So, uh, like I right. was, you know, like I was saying earlier when we first started the encounter. Well, we wouldn't have seen the door from here, but from where we came out of. But since we're back in the back of the room now, we'd be able to see the door. Yeah, uh, even if you're on the floor, you could you could see the door. I mean, even if it was, you could see the top of the door over the ten foot. So you know, if you're six okay. foot tall, you could see you know there's about four a four foot space between you and the top of the ledge. So technically, okay. yeah, you could see the top of the door, not the entire door, but yeah, you could see that there was a door up there. Well, there's another door, Arbadier. Now, if it was a dwarf, uh, probably should... not. Or a halfling or a gnome, probably not. But you guys are all tall, so... Alright, so we probably should check that since I don't see any other doors in here. Sure. I'll quickly... huddle along. Most of my, my ass over here. Oh, we did check what that chest was too, right? Dirt, uh, dirt, nope. He said dirt take the empty chest, so... Okay. Well, one. well, it wouldn't hurt to go check anyway. You go Don't check, go I check. will rogue the door. And I will uh, protect the rogue. Okay. So, as you as you look at this, uh, Lazar, as you... Yeah, you're going to have to change that silver fox as well. Because <laughs> it, it'll, it'll, I love it, but it'll mess up my my macros yeah. and stuff so I do love that though so as you're looking at this chest you notice that it is soaked like the outside of the the chest is actually soaked and in fact it, it feels kind of waterlogged but in the inside it's totally dry and then you could see that there's a like a like a seal around like it was a like a, a watertight box hmm. okay I'm gonna kind of look closer at it, examine it, see if there's anything kind of magical about it at all. Uh, you can give me a, an arcane check. You can, you know, see if you, if you can work your magic on it. You don't think it's magical, but you but you can try nonetheless. Ooh. No, it's it's not. It doesn't have any kind of uh, inscriptions or runes or markings of that nature. Alright, I'll go ahead and try to open it up then. It's already open. It's it's totally empty. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's like I said. Uh, as you're mm -hmm. looking down into it, you know, it looks like there's a. Uh, it looks like it would be a watertight chest, and like I was saying, it, it's dry on the inside, and it's totally waterlogged on the outside of the chest. Okay. Okay. All right. With that, I guess I turn turn around. And keep going then. Hints. 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 Hints, hints, hints. All right. Anybody else want to do anything for you guys? No, I, I'm the roguing the door. I am checking it's for a, traps. It's actually it's locked. partially opened. Oh, what yeah. can I see through it? Uh, you oh, can see that crack. it it goes up, and it is starting. The the sun looks like it is starting to rise now. As you as you look up, it looks like there's like a like a stair cellar that goes up and it's you can see some runes around it and you can see that the light is starting to to come up what'd you find in the chest wizard uh no nothing there wasn't anything in there just empty hmm. alright guys looks like we have our exit here really nice Yep, definitely an exit. Sounds, sounds well, wise enough. I think we should um, head back down. I think we've we've checked everything, right? No, we we know that there's a bugbear still. Oh, do you want to go back and take care of the bug? I don't. I'm kind of tapped out. I think the wizard's tapped out. I think we should go head back to town. Oh, now you're, no, you're tired. Now you're tired. Oh, now that you can't do anything either. Nice. Yeah. I love it. Up on my heels. I don't have any heels, I don't have any, uh... uh no, you're not, you know what? No, so. let's keep going. No, yeah, let's keep going. We're on a roll, right? Okay, I can't, I can't bring you back to life if you die, wizard. <laughs> <laughs> so do you guys want to go, go back into the, uh... 
Do you want to go back into the uh, the hideout here, or do you want to to leave, or what do you guys want to do? You know, we could go back into the, Dave. Can we take a long rest now? Could we go back into that hideout and take a long rest? You can take. Oh my a, god, a long rest! You Are can you take as many long rests as you want. It is a Sometimes. new day now, so. It you guys want to do that? We could take a long rest and then finish with the rest of this uh, area because we have. We're on finished. the chase of our main suspect. Our main suspect. You want to take an hour, eight hour long rest? He's gone. Excuse well, me, well, when did your parents drop you? We've explored every, everywhere except for the crevasse. I yep, don't we think haven't. Lorna we was we in haven't. Here. We haven't searched the crevasse and we haven't searched where bug bears are. Thank you, Utah Jarhead. Places that we haven't even searched yet. Thank you for the follow. Well, that's true. Sir Chuck's a lot. Thank you for the follow as well. Great names tonight, guys. Do you guys want to take a long rest in here? And and sometimes I say we take it here. No, we we go back in that room in the back, take a long rest in there, and then we finish searching this place. But there is something I've been holding out on you guys that I didn't tell you guys. And I feel a little oh. bit bad about it. Dirty, so. dirt, dirt. Spill the beans. You guys want to know. Take up my whip. News. Uh, I didn't tell you guys, but before, when I was hearing the voices in the back room, I did hear uh, that we will not get free passage back through there again. I, I told you we should have fed him those 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 elves. So, yeah. yeah. Well, to that get to the bugbears, we don't have to go through the crevasse. We know we're going to go past the area. Yeah, we're just going to go past the area. Yeah. But we were also saying about searching the crevasse, but letting you well, know yeah, now that. I mean, that's the thing is. What's up, the Martin? only places that Glassstaff can be. <laughs> Better late than never. We man. haven't searched that we know of is where the bugbears are and the crevasse area and possibly like across those bridges because we didn't really go into that area. Yeah. We don't know if there's any tunnels that would go through that area. Right. So, I mean, it's up to you guys if you want to go do the bugbears and if, I mean... If we want to take on the Nothic or not, that's up to you guys. Uh, obviously, you're telling us that we're not going to get free passes, so we'd have well, to take well, it on to search so the crevasse area. Let's take a long rest anyway, and that'll give us time to think on it. And okay. then we'll make up our mind in the morning of what we want okay. to do. Alright. Do that. Anybody have a so problem with I it? I get the bed. I do. All right. the beds. We'll give the old gray hair the other beer, the, the other bed, and I'll me and Stains will stay and Patrickus, watch at the door. Patrickus, thank you for staying. Take it easy, Patrickus. Thank you for hanging out. All right. So you guys get uh, into the uh, you, you know you guys go into the supply room, and that's where we're going to go ahead and call the game tonight. We went well into overtime tonight. Holy cow, did we ever? Just an hour. <laughs> Tonight was uh tonight was Our fun. Team is. Will there be a special song this evening, Dave? There will be a special song after we have words from our sponsors. So uh and in fact uh we're gonna do the we're gonna do the the outro now. So uh, thank you guys very much for playing. I'm gonna head down into the other channel, and we're gonna Thanks, Dave, we're gonna de we're gonna debut this new song, and this is a this is to you know say hello to our. Canadian neighbors to the a north. Tribute. Yes, we are paying tribute to our Canadian neighbors to the north tonight with uh, with a great song that I believe all of the the Canadians would love to hear. So, all right, sure. thanks again for playing, guys. Uh, you guys make it fun, and uh, I'll talk to you later. Uh, if you can hang around, actually, why don't you uh, scan Lazar? Come in and talk to me on Monday or Tuesday about. Let's see if we can work something out with uh, Wild Magic and and your tie. What was the Tides of Chaos? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, let's see. I, I probably might go ahead and do that with a with a long rest. So because I, I I just that's just too much to to give you advantage every single attack. It's just 
that's just too much. So, but I want to continue <coughs> right. to have the, you know, the the surges and stuff like that. So I'm going to oh, give yeah. you a couple of options. I know what I'm already going to do. So I'll have a couple of options for you. And thanks, guys, for playing. I had yeah, fun. Thank it was you. fun. You guys are actually uh, taking a long rest now, and we'll we'll uh, pick up where you left off. So it is now a, so full, a new day. We get our yeah, no, 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 back. no, not yet. We're not done with the full rest yet. So we will, oh, you guys okay. are just starting your full rest now. So all right, guys, oh, I will uh, right. see you guys uh, in a little bit, and uh, see you. See you guys. All right, everybody. So uh, that's pretty much the game for.